Thomas, Chris has just been in, said he wasn't overly happy with his side's performance. How would you assess your side's performance? Well, I cannot be happy. Of course, the result is what we all want, uh, the three points. Today we wasn't able to, to take it. Um, I believe that at least one point would have been uh, good. We didn't make a good performance. We have to be, be honest with ourselves and uh, the way we, we act in the, in the first half is not good enough. It's not good enough. We were still in the changing room when they scored the first goal and um, that's the difference between last week and this week is that the team were focused from the first moment, inclusive in, in the, in the warm-up and they had the feeling that uh, something good were to come. Did you sense there was something wrong before kickoff then today? Or? Excuse me? Did you sense there was the players weren't right? You mentioned the warm up. Then. Well, in the warm up, it, it's just the, the the feeling that you you get. But when you receive a goal in the first minutes, it's you, you cannot allow that. And also, the, the one foul at the end of the first half that you give them the possibility to take it fast. This is living the game. You have to be inside the game in, in these moments. And when you're not, it costs. What do you do about that, though? That's an attitude thing, isn't it, for the players? More than attitude, I think it's uh, concentration, to be focused. And this is the difference between one game and another one. They, they were intense, they were focused on, on the game, knew what they had to do. Everyone looking at the ball, at the man, knowing what to do here, looking down, waiting, arguing, and then they put the ball in the game fast. But even though mm, in the first half it was a bad, bad first half, but we managed to come back in, in the game after we had 10, 10 15 good minutes um, where we played better, but still not good enough. The team were too hectic and uh, and uh, yeah, complicate the the situation too much. And in my point of view, we didn't handle, especially in the second half, to play in the opposite half with patience. This is what we need to play, to touch the ball, to move the ball from one side to another side to create the spaces and and the opportunity, and. We want to arrive in two touches. Very difficult. You seem to struggle in the first half with their formation. Did you, did you consider changing it or did you struggle because your players weren't at their game? Well, uh, we predict this 11 and it was exactly the same 11. Uh, the formation that they played were exactly what we thought. We worked on that, where the spaces were, where to attack, what to do. And that is my problem that we didn't do it. We didn't play uh, with patience, having the ball in the opposite half, moving the opponent. So, But there would be time enough to to analyse the game and, and to, to work on the next and for good it's al already on, on Tuesday. You were disappointed after the Wednesday game, another big derby and you've fallen short again today. I'm, I'm very disappointed. We all expected with the fans, uh, with the support, uh, a special day for Toby, not to take uh, the win in, in a derby. But this is this is the, the league. Sometimes um, this happened, and unfortunately, it happened in in a game, a six-point game. So, but we have to to race again and uh, fight back on Tuesday. Final one from me, Cooper, Liam Cooper, how is he? The problem with his calf? Well, no, he had a dead leg and uh, he couldn't continue in the second half, so we were forced to, to make the, the change.